What's up, bitches? What up, bitches? Check it out, check it out. We are back. We're back, motherfuckers. All right, check it. This is the season finale of the Alex Lester Show. That's right, Holy season thing. finale, not series, all right? Motherfucker. Here's some things to look for in season two, all right? Um, I guess the popularity of the show has been good to us because now we have a sponsor through toughnerdtoys.com, all right? And um, they'll be hooking us up with material, things of that nature. Today, I mean, what's up, man? <laughs> yeah, so one of uh, the first few changes you're going to see in season two, uh, which is going to air next week, is we're doing giveaways, all right? Now, the first giveaway is going to be uh, Resident Evil 5 for the Xbox 360. Now, the contest is I need to see. Uh, the best either combo video, fight video featuring Goken, all right? Um, I will take kind of what, like first 15 per submittees or? Yeah. You know what? I'm not going to really like <laughs> no, it's too like much of a limit. We're gonna go yeah, do but it. whoever can create the best combo video or best fight video with Goken uh, will win Resident Evil 5, the sealed copy from ToughNerdToys.com. All right, I'm getting it. No. Why? Because you're an employee. <laughs> Why? Okay, then. No one affiliated with the show is, is eligible, just like how GameStop does it. It's what? not fair. Alright, so. You're a nice guy! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. You know, so, uh, next week, I will put out uh, pretty much the guidelines as to what I want to see from that. But, you know, just go crazy go ape shit with it all right i, I just want to see combo videos good fight videos if you can make them similar to that uh like some of the combo videos you see from justdefend.com when they were up or show you can you know uh we'll, we'll go on from there it's a very serious thing okay because we have sponsorship now so we're trying to expand and do bigger and better things all right so uh today what we're going to be doing i'm going to show you how to hack the Wii. all right I'm not showing you any games with it, but hey, I'm, I'm free to give out information, all right? Um, I'm going to be showing off Goken's new AI. I released it yesterday, for those of you who don't know. So, it's pretty much a big F you to the haters and stuff, so fuck, fuck, all, fuck all of you. So, um, now, if you want to say Goken is cheap, yeah, he is. I don't give a shit. Fuck you. Anyway. Uh, we're gonna be checking out. We're gonna do some rubber matches in Street Fighter 4, all right? And then uh, we're gonna check out Ninja Blade, the full game. Uh, we're gonna pretty much do small snippets. So we're checking out that Prince of Persia and whatnot. And anything you wanna add, Anomaly? Or yeah, the Street Fighter 4 tournaments, which we're gonna start hosting. Cash prizes. When I mean uh, cash. That will be in season two. <laughs> so. Again, we're doing bigger and better things for, for the uh, new show, alright? Uh, following the Resident Evil 5 giveaway, it's going to be Killzone 2 uh, for the PS3. Uh, in order to win that, there's going to be combo videos or fight videos featuring Dark Trump, alright? But again, we don't want to get too wordy, we're going to get right into the battle. Uh, so we're going to do some, yes, we're going to do some Mojo Road matches also. Alright, so uh, stay tuned. And uh, we look better. We look forward to bigger and better things for season two. Peace. Peace. So, mother. Oh, I, I, I gotta stop doing that. Why you say right. mother? Oh. Check it out, guys. Uh, as promised, I'm gonna show you how to hack the Wii using the SD card and uh, the Twilight Princess hack. All right. So, check it. What you're gonna do is you're gonna boot the game. Alright, you're gonna start game. Now you can get these files from uh, and there's tutorials and all that. Make sure you have a correct SD card. And you're gonna do your thing. I love hacking. You can ask you more from Xbox Live. Yo, is this is only that fucking link turns to a wolf. Yeah, yo, this is hot, yo. What the fuck is all this shit? Look at this shit, man. Yo, Twilight this hack. God, yeah, yeah, Come check on, it. Man. Now, you see, make sure you can run the hack off the SD card, but I don't recommend it because uh, I've seen that it kind of froze on me. So, we're going we're gonna to run this one. Good start. 
Yo, this game kind of hot though. I have to deal with that. But we ain't playing the freaking game. All right, you're gonna walk up to this mofo. That's a bad shit, Russell Wilson. All right, there we go. Oh! All right, now it's, it's, it's installing all the the shit. All right, now since you can't really see, uh, what what you see here is it's giving you uh what functions at the controller like A is to accept, um, B is to cancel, so on and so forth. All right, so I'm gonna what is this? I'm trying to hit A to accept. Shit. What the fuck? Alright, I'm trying to think. Alright, A to accept. Alright. Now it's installing the files to the Wii. And that's it. Hacked. It only took a few seconds, right? Now, it's rebooting. No harm to the Wii whatsoever. Alright. Now what it has done is it put the homebrew channel on here. All right. I don't know who did this or who was behind uh, getting it hacked, but hey, thank you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I thought of it. But similar to what happened with the uh, the Xbox One, where they found a security breach in uh, one of the saves. That's why Microsoft is not backwards compatible on the 360 because Microsoft knows we're going to ass rape that thing. Alright, so here's the homebrew browser. Uh, load. And yes, I do have a Wii, you faggots. <laughs> Alright, it also supports um, network function uh, and you can download shit and whatever. I don't know. Z to me, Wii is is it's not really a hardcore console, but it, it, you know, if you do stuff like this, you can pretty much, you know, turn it into whatever you want. You could get homebrew apps. Like, load the freaking shit. Whatever. I didn't want to get into too much detail anyway, but uh, that's the Wii be being hacked. It only took about five seconds to load the shit to the to the hard drive. Yeah, shit. All right. Mm, Make shit. sure you have a proper SD card, and if you know the Wii is, is is if you only have one Wii, I wouldn't recommend doing it. All okay. right. So. All right, but what did they do after they hacked the Wii? Like, where did? Get yeah, there's a lot of things you can do with it, but I'm not gonna go into too much detail. But uh, you can run homebrew applications on it. You can. You browse the internet, you can boot special games, <laughs> you, you know what I mean, uh, those of you in the hacker world, but uh, you can do, a, it basically opens the, the, the system, you know, where Nintendo, they sell it to you all restricted just to do stuff, you can even run DVDs off of it, uh, so you get DVD playback functionality, which should have been included with the system, but, you know, that's Nintendo for you. You know, I love Nintendo, I grew up with them, but, you know, stop being for kids. You know, kind of get up with the 360 and PS3, alright? So, uh, any words, Anomaly? So, wait, I want to see a game. I, I, mean, I, I don't got shit yet. You don't got Tassin' Up with Capcom? Uh, I, I'll put that next week. Peace oh! out, bitches. <laughs>